Hello, hello. Let's see. Are we good? Or did we fail? Did it, it work? Did it work? I think it worked. Hello? Hello? Alright, sweet. Was it a flawless raid? We made it? <laughs> okay, sweet. Awesome. We love to see it. We love to see it. Hey, guys. We successfully did it. Yes. Yes. Uh, if you follow the Ultimate Guard channel as well, guys, um, there is a... They're going to do, like, giveaways eventually with, like, followers reach, so... That's pretty cool. So follow the channel. <laughs> Long story short, follow the channel. All right. Yeah, that was goaded. What a great idea. <laughs> Yo, Jess, what's up? Okay, where am I? Who are you? This is. I always feel so weird, but um, yeah. Maybe let's play a little bit of the Boros energy to get to get into it, and maybe then we can decide if we want to like do a draft. Maybe you know. Let's do a little bit of Boros Cats to get the vibes. Or do we should, should we do Soren's Cats? I think we were doing Soren's Cats. Let's do more Soren's Cats. Nah, it's true. Thank you. Thank you. What a great idea. We're all peasants together. Did you work on the Psychic Frog emote? How's that going? I always love Elsa emotes. They're so great. Especially like the, the Bjork one fighting. Okay. Soren looks like he would own a cat. Not exactly. Like, Soren has, like, cat girl energy. I do agree. Big cat girl energy. <laughs> cat girl streamer. Yeah, Soren would definitely have, like, the razor cat ear, like, headphone. Headset. I mean, honestly, I don't say Nate. Uh, I don't say no to hand like this. Okay. Um. Artifacts. Hey, no way. <laughs> oh, brother. All right. Let's get that synthesizer. Soren probably has a litter box for his cat that cleans and flushes. <laughs> I believe it. I believe it. Okay, these are some, like, expensive thought seizes, but they're necessary thought seizes. Did they get double Kozilex and ceiling? Okay, that sucks, actually. Oh, that really sucks, Loki. Okay. We got Sorin. If we do Sorin, we can set up Helix, but I don't know if that's what we want to be, like, going for right now. What about a Raptor? All right, we get a Sorin anyway. <laughs> Fives. Sure, like, I'll take it like that, though. You're going to get removed, bestie. Damn it. Okay. I just want to get rid of all of them. Two. Like, no more at affinity stops here. Ooh, we have the Ocelot Pride as well. That's pretty sweet, actually. Okay, I'm going to Helix this. Not extorting. I want to play Pride. Here we go. And we can swing, and then we transform Sorin, and then life is going to be awesome, I hope. So how much life have we gained? Four? That's four damage to the phase? Yeah, I'm not saying no to that. Sorin, burn strategy, we're on it. We're on it. They just have to get the or Ornithopter. It's fine, it's fine, I'll, I'll live. <laughs> Raptor bestie, and I will extort so I can get the Ocelot Pride. 
Flage. Oh, it's Flage. All right. Oh, you're so cooked. <laughs> Because Flage would have made Soren, so Soren would have dealt like five damage because it was Extort plus Flage plus Ocelot Pride. So Soren would have gone for five and Flage would have gone for three, so that was something. Yeah, I, I sometimes I'm like sometimes Soren feels fantastic and other times Soren is a little mid. Remember when I took out my authority over when I when we took out Meltdown for authority of the consoles? I'm regretting it now. Ah, <laughs> uh, we hate to see it. Uh, I guess we're gonna just have to rely on static pris prisons. I guess. Um, I fear. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. It's pretty sweet for sure. I should probably get rid of this thing here too. Where's my... That's my alert box, isn't it? Okay. Mm. This doesn't really... Mosquito. We mold these. Holy, that's a lot of ocelots. <laughs> Whoa! With like with the guide of souls? Whoa! Alright, you know we gotta go in on this, dude. Like you you know we gotta. I'm doing it. Like, I am so doing this. Full, full cats everywhere. Opponent is not ready for the storm. I think I just commit with all the prides. Gonna be like the fastest like route to devotion ever. <laughs> so silly. It's so silly. All right. Cats. That's it. Cats. We keep it moving. Yeah, like a lot of these decks that have like Ocelot Pride, the um the one drop, and uh, you know, Ajani, Raptor, Sorens, and with the Sorens are doing pretty good in modern, so that's kind of like the inspiration behind this. That's kind of the inspiration behind it. If it works in modern, it's gotta work here, right? Ugh, if I get a land of the top, do we believe chat? Land of the top and we're set, you know. Land of the top and we're set. Do it. <laughs> All right. Say less. I'm doing it. Ocelot Pride lives, surely. I think we're like in sort of a mirror anyway. A lot of people are doing it like Lurus and they don't believe in Flages and I'm not sure why because Flage is so good. Flage is really nice. Pom 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 pom. Oh hell no. Pom pom pom. I, I'm afraid it's actually just going to be like self mill. <laughs> or just like not self mill, just mill. Not even rogues. I fear. 
Oof, at least we dodged that. Fable Passage plus Crab. Somebody needs to tell them about pris Prism. Oh, this is a blessing. I might just go a Johnny here first. Because, like, if the Raptor hits removal, I'm not happy. Really, really close to the City's Blessing. Why are you passing the turn for? Oh, let me let me thought seize them first. I need to see what's up. They might actually be rogues. Yeah. Wow, they're just playing like OG, like standard rogues. What a gamer. Sure. <laughs> In the thought seizes, that's fine. I mean, I guess if the Ocelot of Pride dies, I get the Ajani. It seems fine. All right, vibes. Yeah, right. Like, feel free to block the cat, I guess. <laughs> I'll, I'll take it. This deck is, like, really good, too. It's almost like, similar to, like, the other, the other cat deck, and it's, like... It's, uh... Performing, like, crazy, too. Got him. Yeah. How much is the win rate of this deck now? So, like, the other cat deck is 11 and 1. The Boros cats, and this deck is currently 4 0. So, technically, like, 15 and 1. In a way. Oh my god, this mosquito is like. Do I go as hard as to play rest in pieces, or do I just try to, like, screw them over with Flage? Yeah, yeah, I think Rogues and Explorer could work. I don't know if I'd play Rogues and Historic. That's a little div. Yeah, a super small pivot where we're playing Sorens and instead of... Uh... Trying to remember. Sorens instead of Fables. And the Thought Seizes replaced... Mm, what was the Thought Seizes? Philias. Kind of. I still think Boros is better, Loki, but... <laughs> I still think Boros is better based on, like, the lands and stuff, because in his, in Modern, they're, they're playing Black and Air for Grief as well, which, yeah, that makes sense. I don't think I need to go as hard as on Thought Seizes. I think I might want to be on Shava side, so if I can control their creatures, I should be okay. And hopefully Flage, like Flage is kind of like the, having the Kroxa against rogues back in the day. We can just, they're going to help us escape Flage. Mm. So we're going to rely on that. The lands are good. Maybe I will believe. I think calling it a tier 2 deck in Pyo is being very generous, but... Yeah. At some point, it was, like, played quite a bit. I think it was before, like, two sets ago, though. I think. Anyway, why are you milling me all of a sudden? <laughs> all right. Glimpse? On me? Sure. Mm, okay. Thanks for the flage fuel. Not exactly. Okay. A free flage. Something about the name flage is just so fun to say. I don't know. God, it's a little lands though. Shit. It's 
Soren pushed. Praise, yeah. <laughs> Praise, Titan of Fire's Fury. Ooh, a little ocelot. That's great. Okay. Mm. I could be in my Flage era. You know, after all, why shouldn't I? Because it would flip the Soren, so I will do Flage. All right, let's see. I don't think it really matters what else we exile. I don't think we really bring anything back anyway. Is giving Drown? I mean... Do it. Like, I'm just going to do it again, over and over. Flage will be escaped. So, uh, what was the other one again? The one mana, mill two upon entering, and then if opponent's at... Seven, it gets death touch. How's it? How's it read? I think the safest move is to not attack here anyway. I think it's eight. Hmm. Well, I guess. Yeah, okay. It was eight. I thought it was seven. It's really weird. Like, certain of the, some of those cards work on seven in the grave. Others work on, like, eight. Yeah, what are you going to do? Another one? Homie, I'm just going to keep running Flage out. Like, this is not going to work out for you. Like, it's, it's not. It's not going to work out. I will keep Flaging every chance I get, you know? I will keep flaging. I'll probably just like remove the enforcer and like I will just gonna just gonna like create a food token with Soren, I guess. Hopefully we get to like lethal damage next. We can eat the food for three. Hit for three to the phase. Soren will go for six. Nah, it's true, it's true. And she won't stop flaging you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, who's up flaging? Me. Test of talents. Oh, whoa. Okay, but I still have the flage trigger. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I'll extort. <laughs> Soren is going to hit for so much. It's insane. You have to blog, bestie. So Soren already was at four. I would eat the food, make it go to seven. I play the ocelot and extort, make it go to eight. And live my best life. And that was that was the plan. So pretty sweet. Sometimes I wonder like, do you guys think that Nadu is strong enough to carry a historic cookie deck? <laughs> Do we think Nadu is powerful enough to make that happen? Never know till you try. Yeah, I just don't think Gigant is worth by that much on the ladder. Surely. <laughs> Surely. Surely. Turtle plus Nadu and cookies? You mean Kappa Cannoneer? Now hold up. Nadu and Kappa Cannoneer. Pause. Nadu and Nadu plus Kappa Cannoneer. And cookies. That would be adding some strong cards. Hold up. <laughs> Maybe. 
Maybe. I was saying this that that day one. Yeah, you did. A lot of stuff in Cookie Starts, Schooner, Map Tokens, Cliff Ginger. We could try. I know we played against this person. I don't remember what they were playing. Soren. Oh, I think they were playing like Yogg Go Wide or something. Like the historic Yogg deck. Mm, it appears so. There's no flip for me in here, is there? No, there is. But I'd have to buff Soren with Guide of Souls. I don't think that's worth doing. Yeah, it kind of feels like a waste to me. I might still just like put the energy on him though and like just make him like a good attacker. Then if we're ever in, like, desperate times, we can always flip them. It's not a May. But Johnny has a May? Anyways, I guess... Oh, okay. I just thought they all had Mays. Ah, okay, okay. Shit. All right. I... Yeah, read the card, explains the card. I decided not to... That's on me. That's on me. Mm, new Soren, who this? Yeah, I'm probably cool at extorting this. So then Soren hits for two, of which I will remove the Guide of Souls. And then with the Discharge, I'm going to get rid of the Gilded Goose. God, I, can, I need to be really careful I don't gain enough life, because I don't want this sword to flip again. That's kind of a potential problem in the future. If it's a May effect, then, like, you could be kind of screwed. <laughs> Interesting, that. So, whereas two of Johnny's is, like, awesome, two Sorens is pretty rough. I mean, I guess you could, like, manipulate it in a way that you gain a bunch of life after... on your second main phase, so he doesn't have to flip, yeah. Yeah, that has to be the only way out. It's interesting. Rawls and May also. Right, so then I can attack with Guide, but I'm not going to. I can then eat my food. Second main, Soren deals five damage.
All right. Go, Sorin. <laughs> Cauldron familiar. Oh, bestie. Oh, bestie. Okay, I think we win here. So we need to make a food. Then we're going to do Galvanic Discharge targeting Ocelot Pride. I guess I can do this. Oh, it's actually much easier than I thought. Because I can just do combat, swing with Sorin, take action, make him fly. I can then eat the food, just Sorin transforms. I can eat my food and I can throw how much into their face? Eight damage? <laughs> it's not bad though, like it's not bad. It's not bad. Yeah, you know. It is not bad. All right, Yog. You opponent's name? What is what is their name? Do they have a weird name? The two Sorens worked out. No, nah, it sure did. It sure did. In the end, it worked out. Sixty-one special. I guess better off not knowing. I guess. Okay. What do we have? Two Guide of Souls and an Ocelot Pride and a Static Prison? That's probably a keep. Ultra America vibes? Oh, I must not be familiar. Yo, I might get cooked. I just gotta go like super wide with these ocelots maybe. Chat, do you want to see a draft after this? I would do a poll, but I don't know if I can start a poll on this channel. I don't think I can. Draft pause champ? Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck that. Minus. Fuck that. The fact that Arena like allows usernames like this is crazy. Cookie Brew? Maybe we can do the Cookie Brew on like my own channel. Can I start a poll in here? I don't think I can. I'm I'm a moderator. Unrecognized. Yeah, fuck that. Um, it's not looking good for me, y'all. <laughs> I think it's just a concede. I'm on a one lander too. Mod should be able to start a pull. I can start a pull though. Do I? I, I don't. I can start it. I'm in like mo mod view. 
reward requests, suspicious activity. I can start predictions, I think. No, widget not available on channel. Mm. Nah, I don't think I can do it. I fear. Yeah, slash pull doesn't do it. No, it's true, it's true. Like, whoever is in charge of, like, the ultimate card stream needs to make it a lot more streamable. Not just an empty shell, you know? Now it's just an empty shell. The writhing Chrysalis. Oh yeah, the mythic woman or something. I've seen it. I've seen stories. I guess I'm just going to ask you guys to put one or two in the chat and whatever I think is the dominating like number is what we'll do, possibly. Yar, I think rope line attendance is really good for them. I'm going to get rid of that. Also, they kept the hand with no green in it. You are so confident. <laughs> like, damn, bestie. They're just like, nah, surely I'll draw it. Skyfisher spider. They don't even have green. They're like double black. Snap keep. And they hit it. Get out of here. Revive it. At least an affiliate half pulls. Well, they have to be getting there by now, right? Or what is it? What are they needing? Like, uh, stream time? I guess. Ooh, rope line attendant. Don't like that very much. Uh oh, that's bad news. I need to draw a little bit better now. I'm not drawing better, I'm just drawing lands. Oh no. Uh, okay. I'm cooked now. I think I've just drawn too many lands. No, I think there's things that you can do, but I don't know if whoever is running his channel is too familiar with being a streamer. I don't know if it's my spot to try and, like, help them out with that. It's my other point. But yeah, there's definitely a lot of things you could do to make this a lot more interactive. Like, follower, like, alerts and stuff. Like, there's nothing set up. No bots, no alerts, no mini games for, like, chat interaction. It's the bare minimum. Alright, I've just flooded. Entering my consultant era. Yeah, like, for money. <laughs> Alright, right. We just, uh, that was not it. Alright, guys. So, here it is. Be ready, be ready, be ready. Have your fingers on your keyboard. Or whatever touch screen you have. Because you can choose. Okay? Type 1. If you want to see me do, uh, Modern Horizons Limited. Type 2. If you want to see me, like, brew more. Okay, that's an overwhelming number of ones <laughs> so far. The ones are doing it, I think. Oh god, now it's going to get difficult. More ones? Okay, okay, I think I see a 
a good amount of ones in here. But we can always, if Mother Rice is limited as a flop, we're gonna brew, so don't go anywhere. What size does Emo need to be? Mm, I think just like, maybe like 128 by 128, and then it's gonna like downscale, maybe try that. Okay, so we're gonna start off with limited, and if that flops, we're gonna we're gonna brew. Okay, how about that? Uh, premier draft. Okay, so as always, chat, feel free to yell what I'm supposed to pick. We're gonna be entering the bronze cues. This doesn't mean that I have to listen to what you're saying, but your suggestions are uh, welcome. Just always take an Eldrazi. God, I'm, I'm always leaning towards like energy and aggro decks, so I'll have to like get over that. Psychic Frog or Redraft. <laughs> okay. Oh, what is this? Whenever another non token permanent you control leaves the battlefield, choose one that hasn't been chosen. Create a creature token with those characteristics. Characteristics? A rat? Okay, well, is this not the homie then? <laughs> uh, all right, chat. What are we thinking? Yeah, Genku seems pretty well rated. Chrysalis. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, everybody says Chrysalis is like broken, so. <laughs> The best limited card this decade. Sheesh. All right. I'm going to go Chrysalis then. We'll just do a, how many Chrysalises can we pick up? We're in like the bronze draft queue. So there's maybe a shot that we have a high chance. <laughs> of uh, picking up some good stuff. Um... I mean, probably Fang Flames, I guess. Hydra is good too. Fang Flames, like, removal is never bad, right? You guys would pick Hydra over Flames? I mean, I get the synergy with the, chrys the Chrysalis or whatever, but Fang Flames, like, removal is never bad, right? Like, I, I, I really like removal limited anyway. I'm a flamed enjoyer. All right, there we go. We found another Hydra. Path. I mean, there's six synergy with the chrysalis in that, right? All right, I'm going to do path. Like, these are my homies. Conwood Goblin and Cranial Rem. Like, <laughs> the urge, the urge. Oh, wow. That seems pretty good. I think you pick up the land, right? Ooh, swag is a face that only a mother could love. Yeah. That, that's correct. <laughs> So this is kind of chunky. Maybe it's a uh, dread mask. Or than anything else, I guess. Primal Prage. Damn, like energy seems pretty. Uh... Open. What's the move here? No. These are all kind of like mid, aren't they, chat? Check Discord, let me know if okay. All right. Mm. 
maybe just like the nesting grounds because we're playing Eldrazi guess <laughs> hopefully all right let's see you got the emote honestly you probably did the best you could with that card You probably did the best you could. Black seems super open. I think, yeah, I think our pack one pick one chrysalis might be what everybody else is doing. <laughs> Who would have thought? Uh, it appears Gruel is very much not open. It appears so. <laughs> Yikes. Well, we can always be in like, you know, white green. Which is like modified, isn't it? Mono dread mask. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. I don't know. I guess we have a switch to like modified if all else fills. So we might want to pick up the faithful watchdog here. I guess. As a little bit of insurance. Because our colors are not looking good. Landscape's pretty sweet. What is Umbra Armor? If a giant creature would be destroyed, instead of remove all damage from it and destroy this aura. Modified. God, I think we're getting absolutely hated out. <laughs> um. Somebody snapped the Hydras up? Yar. Dude, whatever. Okay. Me rare drafting. <laughs> intentionally, by the way. Intentionally. Okay. I think we're, uh... We're getting threat threatened here. Oh fuck, I grabbed it, right? Gamers? What do we have here? Pearl... Ear? Enchantment spells have affinity for auras. Whenever you cast an aura spell that targets a modified creature. Well... Yeah, okay, so now it's like, what do we do? Are we going Pearl, or are we gonna do- are we, like, being stubborn and we're gonna commit to the chrys Chrysalis? Pearl cameo. Everybody's like chrysalis. <laughs> All right. I'll do it, man. I'll do it. We'll stay committed. I see another Fang Flames. Raptor is not going to be good in this deck. No, I understand that chrysalis is absurd. The, the hive mind, the sheep. We're all familiar with what's going on on Twitter. It's a good card. But there's also this thing called hate drafting or like, you know, someone else being in your colors. And that might make the chrysalis a little bit worse. You know. So, um, but yeah, I guess I'll stay committed. Seems to be a lot red in this pack, so. Talks for them, these are ours. Sure. <laughs> we should stay stubborn. All right, I like it. Ooh. 
Well, we're not really an Amped Raptor deck, though. That's my my problem right now. I mean, I love the Amped Raptor. I might just get it for its stats as a two, like, two mana, two on its first strike. Seems to be the best that we can do in this pack. <laughs> so maybe that's just good enough for me. I am very familiar. That is my bestie. Absolutely get this one. Oh, this is also... Oh, this is hard. Gotta be Stomp, I think. Gift of the Viper memes, say less. Raptor into how is Raptor still around? Pick six, y'all. Like, I guess everybody has just fully given up on like energy or some shit. Raptor into Raptor, the dream. Charge bug with haste, honestly, is not bad. I'm not a charge bug hater. Seems like fine. Raptor hit filler, I guess. Well, this hold me better carry, guys. Because we're going to need that. <laughs> you bet the, the crystal is better carry. Two of the best card in the format. Surely, surely we go undefeated. Easy, easy. We hit third chrysalis. Oh, we do every time. It's a common. Come on now. Every time. Whenever you cast or cycle, carry to zero and Eldrazi. Do we just want to get this big boy at the top end? I mean, this is a good land to the Reign of Glory. But we might just want to grab the big boy. Oh, I don't know if that automatically means I'm going to be in teamer, but... Yeah, still big enough, I guess, big boy. Eldrazi Ravager? All right! Sure. Ogres. Mm, this gets red at least, sure. Path tap stuff for any color. Uh, Eldrazi, you can draw a tap at one man of any color. So yes. All right, that's in our colors. Another chrysalis, please. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys, it's easy. We've grabbed three rares. Let's go. It's so easy. It's, this game is so easy. Another one. Thank you. Another one. Uh, what are we grabbing here, though? 7-0 incoming. Mm, I mean, Solar does ramp us up. Yeah, I can see Solar. Solar rules would be nice hit with Raptor if we get it. Limited streamer, Pog. Yeah, you know it. Chat wants to see some limited. That's what they're going to get. A little treat here on the Ultimate Guard channel. A little treat for the chat.
if this X flips, we get it, we get to go on Twitter and tell all the people molding about chrysalis that they're stupid. That's true. We can we can literally tell everybody that they're dumb. Sounds fun. Let's do it. Yeah, let's start. Let's start shit on Twitter. Is it ever like snapping void crawl? I mean, it probably is. I'm not sure if we can afford to like play blue in here. We do have one fetch that grabs blue. And passive annihilation also makes blue. We also have some blue synergy here on the drown yard lurker. So maybe we have a slight splash of blue going for us. I yeah, I open them. Pack one pack one pick one every time. <laughs> uh we have the temple. <laughs> uh vibe check? What do we grab? Is it just like gatekeeper? Well, the Twitch channel has better RNG. <laughs> I mean, I guess the gatekeeper goes pretty hard with Chrysalis, right? Like the... The creatures entering and stuff. Eldrazi repurposer. When you cast a spell, when it dies, create a zero one Eldrazi. Good card. Mm, I'm thinking it's repurposer. Or, I mean, Hydra we could put our mana into. That is true. That is true. Yeah, that's probably fine. Reach and trample. Yeah, that's probably fine. Yeah, it's a good, it's a good mana sink. It's a good mana sink. Not happy with any of this, really. Um, yeah, but I don't think we ever want to be in a position where we want to, like, play turn the narrative. I think Gift of Viper memes could just get the job done in bronze. <laughs> like, I gotta be real with you. In bronze, it's probably fine. A little bit of a cool metric in bronze, probably fine. Ugh.
Cranial rem last car, damn. Mm, I think we're unfortunately going to have to play some bad cards in here. Oh, that's actually not as bad as I thought. Well, it is because I don't think Arena counts the dual face lands. So we have. This is like 17 lands. This is like 18, 19 lands. Yikes. I mean, we might just have to make it work. <laughs> we might just have to make it work. I mean, we were definitely, like, getting hated on a bit, you know, and, uh... Let's believe in the, the chrysalis, I guess? Let us believe, chat. I would do a prediction, but it's turned off on this channel. I fear. But all in all in chrysalis for sure. Okay, sure. All right. I see no chrysalis in my opening hand. We're cooked. We're so cooked. Yo, yo, bold entreaty. Yeah, we draw into them easy. Every time. Snapping, Void Crawl, our bestie. Everybody's just a little drowsy, huh? <laughs> Everybody's just a little drowsy. Who would have ever thought that Eldrazi would be strong cards? That's just so strange. Who, like, who came up with that? So weird. Hmm. I guess I like played a bug and like I gotta find green with the landscape, I think, so. I'm not even sure if Chrysalis could save us, dude. I'm feeling very, uh, doubtful. <laughs> I don't know if Chrysalis could save. Mm <laughs> hmm. You believe? Okay, that's good. Thank you. Read some believers up in here. I feel like they're doing what we're trying to do, but like they're doing it infinitely better. <laughs> oh, brother. They were probably make, uh, in a draft where they didn't get hated out, I fear. Probably. <laughs> oh. 
All right, what do I have here? I could tap this for two. What if I just create a huge smelt charge bug? But it, that's not going to change anything for me, I think. These could all be flung for two damage to any target. Mm, fuck it, we ball. Big charge bug. Okay, then what? <laughs> I'm not sure. I am not sure. They're grueling, like, so much harder than us. It's ridiculous. Yeah, we play that too. Jeez. I mean, I can two for one myself. Whenever it attacks, you may pay two. If you do, another target attacking creature gets plus one plus zero and gains menace. Charge bug itself doesn't get plus one, right? Damn. Okay. We're just gonna like fang flames. Big yikes. It's called versatility, you know. <laughs> it's called versatility. Yeah, I'm I'm slowly becoming a commander player, dude. Every time I like get kicked with like shit RNG during qualifiers, RCQs, tournaments of any other kind, Commander becomes infinitely more appealing. <laughs> Every time. It's just the universe. It's all all roads lead to Commander, I fear. Yeah. All ro roads lead to Commander. I'm now, yeah, I'm now a full-grown mo moth, for sure. Yeah, like... <laughs> Commander as a side job. <laughs> yeah. It's giving. Oh my god, what's going on? Bestie Commander show. I live in Europe. It's always gonna be hard to do a Commander show over here. Unless you do, like over like uh what is it spell uh webcam commander force l to play magic yeah just get a group of goth girls goth girl commander I mean this is not gonna do shit for me I'm cooked right Or is Eruption good enough? But do they not, like, throw? I mean, I guess I only have two mana up. I don't know. I guess I could try.
On my land, the destroy target land, it's controlling my search light for basic. You should have flying can block this turn. Can I just go after my opponent's land? Why do I have to go after my own? Does that matter? I guess they could get a ret, but it would be tap, right? I don't think they can fizzle if I target their island. Anyway, I'll target myself then. You guys have made me scared. <laughs> you guys have made me scared. I'll target myself. I don't... I think it's fill proof to target them, but... I've been spooked by the chat. I don't know if I can pay twice. Actually. Yeah, just one is fine, right? Or no? Just don't do anything. Don't gain one life. Don't do anything. Don't gain life. Don't bounce. Don't... <laughs> Whatever. I don't know. Untap. Well, untapping doesn't matter. There's some flesh creatures. Don't do that either. All right. I really don't think we should have won that game, but <laughs> take it. Uh, we'll take it. I don't. I don't think we should have won that though. Easy clap, no struggle, light work. Um, keep it going. This time around, chrysalis. Seriously, I'm saying like the bug. The bug has always felt good for me whenever I played with it. Bug better than Chrysalis, confirmed. Chrysalis check. Check field. Chrysalis check succeeded. But okay, red man on here. Okay. I could find a mountain. Yeah, hopefully. Everybody in gruel colors. I want to avoid playing stump, but like I feel I might have to now. To like guarantee, oh, well, I don't have to actually. I still have. I don't have to. I'm holding as long as I can. Wait, your draft? Pfft, no idea. Not a limited expert. Just happy that my opponent's playing nothing out. <laughs> Nine of ten. <laughs> There's no way in hell. I just have a few chrysalis. I mean, maybe that's all you need, huh? Perhaps it's enough. Hmm. 
Yay! Oh my god, oh my god, it's a bomb. It's a mythic bomb. Oh my god, everybody. Woo! Crazy shit. Holy. Woo! Wow! It's insane. It's insanity. I start sweating, bestie. Start being really scared, dude. I mean, I just think I need the ramp. It's kind of my problem. Can, can I cast a Ravager? I can cast a Ravager. But why do I feel like going after the Guardian seems to be the right play? Eh, fuck it, big Eldrazi. Eh, fuck it. I think that's just how you're supposed to play this, like, limited format. <laughs> just say fuck it, big Eldrazi. I think that's uh, more the vibe. Yeah, <laughs> fuck it, Eldrazi. I mean, I'm always very fond of cruel drafts anyway, but uh, yeah. Eldrazi has died, but this has got Annihilator 1, so... Slay. They made this a limited stompy as hell. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. People figured out pretty quickly that the, uh... Ain't no way, ain't no way. Dog Umbra? Do I have ways to get rid of that? Just gonna get to the, the drown yard lurker, I guess. Seems to be the, the move. Seems to be the slay. Okay. All right. Plus one, plus one, death dodge. I actually am the urge. <laughs> Do I go for it, chat? Do I go for it? Two, four, death dodge? We say, fuck it, we ball? We ball? Balling? They never expect the gift of the viper? The snake slash danger noodle. I do like I do always I'm always tempted by the little combat trick as a treat whenever I'm playing uh Limited. Okay.
also have the opportunity for a huge hydra so neck i am i was thinking drown your lurker however hydra as an x is what is it uh four on this thing like we would be working with death touch trample that's kind of slay you know I kind of dig it. I kind of dig it. It's very all in. I, but do they have a way to remove in green like this? I want to say no, though. I don't know. I can. I cannot think of anything that they could have here to remove my void claw because most things are like fight spells. But you're not gonna fight me with a two three, so. I don't know. Second dog Umbra would be the worst case. Yeah, that wouldn't be cute. But then we still have the Drowned Yard Lurker as backup. It was used to trick to save the dog? Nah. I don't know. Anyways, huge 6 8. With Trample? With Death Touch, with Reach, with tap to draw a card, tap to ramp up. Yeah, yeah, right? Like, I don't think any fight effects can kill, so that seems to be, like, pretty safe. Crystalline Giant crying. Dude, wow. Wow. That was fucked up. Death touch. Aha. Opponent got answers, but we got answers too. And we still have two chrysalises in our deck, so you should be conceding, opponent. You should be conceding. What is that? For fuck's sake. No, wait, they do have perfect answers. <laughs> no, wait, never mind. They do have it. They do have it. They do have it, I'm afraid. <laughs> I am definitely ain't no way, ain't no way, for sure. Yikes. Big yikes. Alright, deal with chrysalis. You can't. You won't. I'm better off drawing cards, I think. <laughs> There and there it is, folks. We're saved. I hope. And there it is. <laughs> and just like that, we won the game, yeah. <laughs> just like that, the game is ours. Easy. Well, opponent, opponents just out here like manifesting the perfect answer to the top of their deck. Don't mind them. They've been doing it all game. They're going to do it again. All right, don't mind me as I'm just drawing a card here. 
Interesting. They're really out here, like, fighting something with Death Dodge, huh? <laughs> yeah. Well. That's not on the... Uh, that's not on me. I only have one red source. Mm, whatever. It's fine. No, that's what I'm saying. Like, Death Touch Unlimited is OP. Just like flying is OP. Oh, yeah, I can just untap it. You're right. I forgot we had this thing. Oh, well, there we go anyway. Okay. Looking pretty good still. I would say. Yeah, John, it's fine too. Well, opponent, how are you going to get out of this one? You're not... I don't know what they have in their hand, though. They still have four cards. Like, is it all lands? That'd be crazy, right? Surely not. Give me like, a second here. Surely not all lands. Okay. Is this just like salt rope? Do we really have to suffer here? Probably. Out of water again. They appear to be molding. They sure are. Waiting till the very last second to drop a land. What a top tier bitch. Seriously. Don't it just drop an Angel of Ruins again? Like, are you good? Like, what the fuck? What is going on with them? Acting as if they're in trouble, me to just have an Angel of Ruins? Like, what? Alright, let me thin this out. Yeah. Alrighty, so what is the play? Swing with Chrysalis, Fang Flames to finish off the Angel, and then Slam Dreadmask? I guess so. I should be slow rolling this too, but honestly, no, I don't want to. We have another half an hour left here on the channel, and I'm not wasting it. Before Third Angel. <laughs> don't fucking say that. Don't say that. They, you know they will, like... You know they will. It's just gonna take them about, like, another ten minutes to end up playing that, and then, uh, you know... Yikes. Well, let's put some good music on. Did they finally concede? Oh my god. What a dream. 
You know what? Chrysalis did feel pretty good there. You know? Chrysalis felt pretty good. Our mythic common slaying. All right, doing pretty good. I realize put it on the screen. All right, let me go grab some uh, some water real quick. Give me a second here, as we're like waiting to queue up, anyways. All right, as expected, we're still not queued up. <laughs> sure. Mmm, what is this? I mean, I got chrysalis as a snap key for me anyway. We're in a rush. If you, if you get a couple out at the same time, yeah, that'd be sick. Oh, ooh. <laughs> ooh, ask and you shall receive. Ooh. I'm playing constructed. I am playing constructed. Okay. Charge bug. Uh, I mean, you're not good enough to remove, I don't think. Yeah, that feels like a waste for me. No way we get a third, right? Right? That'd be crazy. No way that happens. Uh huh. Uh huh. Did the lonely charge bug? Oh, wow. Ruby medallion cast. Anyways, here's uh, Chrysalis. Sweet. They're gonna be storming. <laughs> sure. If they end up storming in draft, then I will just give them the win. It's that simple. Like I will I would be so impressed that they will just get the win for me. Bronze players are already playing the amulet. Yeah, I don't know. That sweet discount, though. I mean, I guess they're... Maybe they care about it for affinity reasons. Okay. Lots of roping in this, like, bronze lobby. Jesus. Okay. Give the Viper a L F G. Yeah, I'm just gonna slam another Chrysalis. Like this is too good to pass on, surely. <laughs> I think the only appropriate reaction to double Chrysalis is just conceding the game. That that does make a lot of sense, you know. 
that yeah like now nah, nobody blames you for that one bestie like that seems about right yeah <laughs> the instant concede <laughs> uh honestly fair yeah honestly very fair it's a very dumb card like it's very dumb When are we jumping on Twitter? Yeah, we need to we need to join. We need to grab our torches and join the chrysalis haters. <laughs> the chrysalis haters. We need to join them. And yeah, literally, chrysalis was our pack one, pick one, pack two, pick one, and pack three, pick one. We hit it every time. We got rewarded. Pretty uh pretty pretty impressive. It was worth it. I mean, hell yeah. Like, I'm not regretting it right now. I was very tempted to, like, swap into, like, Celestia at one point, but I'm not regretting anything right now. Premium drafts only. Yikes. This is just a lot of green. Uh, but I could get the Path of Annihilation. That would kind of, like, fix me. But I also see no Chrysalis. So I'm just going to mole. See, that's better. <laughs> I like that better. Man, I Molten Gatekeeper with Chrysalis is so nice though, chat. I'm gonna believe. I'm so believing in this. I wonder if someone has ever drafted five Chrysalis. that would be so impressive all right this is definitely going to flop but it's okay all right we're gonna need to land though All right, don't be shy. Give me a land in my, like, fucking 20 or, like, what is it? 19 land draft deck? Surely, chat. Surely. Couldn't they have removed an energy counter from me? <laughs> All right, silly. Oh man, I missed all my land. Oh no, don't do this. I whiffed on land. Hold and pray, hold and pray. Deals four damage to target creature. Oh, sheesh. Sheesh, sheesh. That's a good card. Chrysalis got reached though, so one time for the one. Let's go. Come on now. Give me the bestie. Give it to me, Rachel. Show it to me, Rachel. What do they think? Do they have an attack? You're crazy if you think you do. <laughs> it's the meme it's the meme it's not it's not personal it's the meme oh yeah okay sure whatever um yeah another oopsie huh mythic mythical magic or am i crazy 
Who's the crazy one, me or you? Mythical magic. A lot of work to do. All right, chrysalis time. Let's go. The molten gatekeepers are pinging them. All right, three pings. A free lightning bolt with a rhythm chrysalis. I mean, that's like pretty much stonks to me. Nice dragons would be a shame if somebody had chrysalis. Uh huh. I guess they can do some like shenanigans with menace from the charge bug. But we'll see if that's going to work out for them. They're not really looking good on energy. Let's go, baby. Honestly, like, I probably swing here. <laughs> Chris Sussy. <laughs> uh, yeah. Vibes. Opponent, you are in a very rough spot right now. I'm not sure if you realize it, but... Five check. Gonna make them sweat a little bit, you know, with the upcoming turn. But I still want to be, like, respectful of anything crazy that they might have, so. Because they do have, like, menace on one of the dragons. But I'm at 13, so. Chrysalis clutches these every time. Okay. Come on now. Long rope to see, try and see if there's a way for them out of this. Are they like doing math with like the simulacrum or something that they can deal like four damage to my chrysalis? Okay, we're just gonna have to sit through it again. I swear we spent more time getting roped and limited than we actually spent time playing. Honestly, like, they're not dead here, though. Like, that's kind of the thing. They're really not dead here. I got good flyers. Unless I forget about this massive bow that's on the chrysalis. But surely. Yeah, I showed you my chrysalis. Please respond. Oh, no, they just passed. Oh, 
I was giving them like priority though. You gain X life? A yo? A yo? Yeah, I'm not out of this yet, dude. <laughs> yeah, I we have no choice. And like they have like double buffs as well. So like six power and flyers. There's menace potential. Charge book put them to seven. Like, yeah, it's like I can't really um do anything here. I mean, eventually we're going to like be able to attack with the, you know, the draft mask, but yeah, we got to be respectful, I think, for sure. For sure. You got to respect. Mm. Okay. Well, this better save you. Let's check something. Can't cycle that. Chrysalis swing or a chrysalis uh, dread mask. Let's see. Well, they're going to put the counters on the helikites. Okay. I don't know if I care. I wish I had the the, fa the fang stuff. So, but that would force them to do that right now. Uh, I'm just gonna pass. Considering like switching to dread mask, but I kind of want them to commit the simulacrum first. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, but I think I want them to take the action of like spending the mana and removing the blocker, right? Because if I do it for them, like what's the use, right? So, yeah, I don't, I don't think I do that. I think it's we can always still do it next turn. Oh, out of everything, <laughs> you move the gatekeeper. Oh. See, now I'm glad I didn't do it. Because you know that has an earth too. All right. Now I'm really glad I didn't take the action because. It's pretty valuable. Okay. 
It's pretty fucked up. I'm bronze, what do you mean? No, it is gold, but I'm in bronze. So, <laughs> if that's something to go off of, then, uh... Okay. What does plus six plus six on a chrysalis do? Eleven, twelve chrysalis with a gatekeeper to be a thirteen. No, 12, 13 chrysalis, and then you still have the sacrifice. Mm. 12 power. Would that force them to block with the two Hellkites? I think it does, right? Chat? I don't think they can do... Or, like, they have to block with this Hellkite, right? Wait, is this not... Oh, never mind. Okay, so it's just 12. No, because, like, this is 8. It's 13. I thought for some reason that, like, living weapon was going to work with artifacts, but... Now it works. I think I might just, like, choose Impatience. And commit. I'm just gonna keep it going, right? I think the more time I give my opponent, the worse things, worse things become for me, so... Yeah, I think we just gotta, like, put a little bit of gas. Yeah, there's no way for me to get rid of both. Like, I'm not dealing 13. Okay. Shouldn't have done the unearth, but I saw living weapon and I was thinking of the one that like buffs artifacts. All right, five, eight, nine, ten, eleven. They got eleven toughness total again. I mean, we might just put it on like the Eldrazi spawn, the Dread Mask, and like try again, right?
It's tricky, dude. It's tricky. Another three toughness. Perhaps four. Four toughness. Yo, it's an Eldrazi Ravager. But if I put a 6-6 six, six on this, like, little guy, the opponent has to put, like... It's either Sentry plus Snake, and then I take one. I don't know. I'm just gonna play this. Mosquito. Yeah, the, the token returns, so it's whatever. Yeah. I was holding it to try and like buff or like bluff combat tricks, but I don't think it, there's any use anymore. So, it's what it is. So Drazi Ravager is gonna look pretty with a dread mask on it though. Let's go. Big boys. Yeah, surely a twelve twelve is something, right? Like, opponent, you got one card, dude, okay? Like, <laughs> I had, like, a Dread Mask of Inkle. What are you thinking about? That's what I'm want- that's what I want to know. Mm. What? Well, here we go, yeah. <laughs> So, this Hellkite swings for eight. I double block the sentry and shove a something in front of the Ophiomancer. I, I live like, right? I mean, what if I just do this plus this? I take six, seven, eight plus an additional two. I take 10. Yeah, seems good to me. Like, Your question remains, what do they top deck? Is it like Blackheart, the consuming corruption? I don't think that would save them though. Before they go to eight, they'd be dead still. Yeah, the slow roll's killing me, dude. Like, you're boring everybody. You're boring the audience. S please step it up. Damn, victimize? 
How are they like just drawing like this though? But it's fine. Like they're all tapped anyway. So you could have just fucking conceded, dude. You chose not to. Why? No reason at all. Damn it, man. <laughs> like, damn it, man. Killing the vibes for everybody. Great, we won, yeah. They put up a fight, though. Like, holy, they, they really put up a fight. I'll give them that, but I'll give them minus... Like, minus, like, a negative points. Many negative points for slow rolling us like crazy. But, yeah, pretty impressive, I guess. Pretty impressive. <laughs> Alright, 4-0. Oh my god, I can't. What? There we go. How's the time? What do you mean? I like I would do one more draft, but it's like if this is gonna take another thirty years, I don't want to do it. <laughs> it's another like slow roller. I don't want to do it. I'm gonna try though because I'm just like it's been a long day already. We've had a long stream behind us. It's been like six and a half hours or something. So I'm really hungry and quite exhausted, but if it's another person that's roping me the entire time, I'm just going to concede out of it. <laughs> you know? We always have, like, a few more losses left anyways, saving, uh... Saving Grace. Okay. Can't even find a game, I think. Can't blemish 7 0. Nah, you're so right. Nah, we're not even going to be able to like queue up, dude. Um, all right. So, everybody. Um, I think tomorrow is going to be my, uh, my day off. I'm pretty sure. I, I'm, I think so. Yeah, I, I think it is. Cause like, I, I, I was hoping to have plans with my dad, but I think he built on me for my nephews. <laughs> I think he built on me for my nephew. So that feels good. Um, especially when I organized the plans and was going to give him a gift, but. You know, who cares? Um, but yeah, so I mean, I probably still do it because I kind of like need to like rest up a bit and stuff. But thank you all so much for hanging out in these both both of these streams. Thank you for joining me on my own channel. And thank you for joining me on the Ultimate Guard channel. Don't forget to follow the Ultimate Guard channel. There's a great roster of streamers, content creators, pros, players, everything that uh, is going to go live like relatively frequently on here. We have our own like schedules. I think most players are expected to, uh, most people that are sponsored by Ultimate Guard are expected to be live like two times a month. So yeah, if you want to like follow the channel and also be eligible for future giveaways by doing so, that is uh, your best bet. Um, you can also check out Ultimate Guard on Twitter and stuff and uh, they will post like schedules. Also Instagram of who is going to be live that day and like what time they're going to be live in case you want to check out some some creators. Uh, I'll mostly always be like rating for my own channel, so you don't have to worry about that. Uh, but yeah, it was a good stream. We had great success on the ranked ladder with uh, the... What did we play again today? Goldfish Brain. We played the Soren deck, which was cool. The Boros Cats was nice. The, the like, you know, um, Dredge was interesting. But I think we won quite a lot of games anyways. And tomorrow we're going to see if maybe... Both Nadu and Capital Cannoneer could make Cookies a historic playable deck. Well, I guess not tomorrow, Wednesday. But it could be that I have to swap my days off. So just keep an eye out on my Twitter, as always, or Discord, if you're not in there, on uh, what's going to happen with my days off. But thank you for hanging out, gamers. Thank you for the resubs, thank you for subs. And if you follow the Ultimate Guard channel, thank you for doing that. And with that being said, thank you for watching. Have a good night, everybody. And uh, see you in the next one.